Hello everyone, my name is Dorothy Chia and thank you for watching my YouTube channel Dorothy Chia Piano. I am doing a series of five days of limited edition uh, that deals with piano competition and uh, I hope you will stay tuned if you want to find out about all things to do with piano competition. In my interest uh, of this topic dealing with piano competition, I am speaking from my own experience as a competition competitor back in the days when I was a student. Uh, practically about every year, my teacher would sign me up for various competitions at the uh, local level as well as at the state level. And this was back in the days when I studied in the US. Coming back to Singapore, I've also uh, sat in the adjudication panel of various competitions held here in Singapore, some of which are the Cristofori Piano Competition, the Yamaha Piano Competition, and most recently, the 5th Steinway Youth Piano Competition. Today, I'm going to talk about um, the value of competitions and this is part one of my five-part series on piano competitions. The value of competitions are many and usually in uh, any piano studio, most teachers would handpick a few of the um, students that are very, very talented and very driven and they, those that need a little bit more challenge in their piano learning. So today I'm going to talk about the value of piano competitions for this particular group of students. Piano competition uh, serves as a yardstick of measurement. So this student uh, could be the best, uh, the cream of the crop in a particular teacher's studio. But as a further push to their level of playing, uh, competition serves as a very good basis for for a yardstick of measurement to how the student perform uh, with their peers uh, at a state level or even at an international level. So I usually encourage students who are starting off a competition to perform at a more localized level before they get the experience and exposure to move on to a national or international level. So competitions are very, very good means of practicing how to perform and more importantly, how to perform under stress. Okay, the skill of performance hopefully is a skill that all pianists eventually should learn as part of their growing growth into a musician. All right? Learning a piece of music is best shared and enjoyed with an audience. And competition is a type of performance where you perform to a panel of judges who then gauge you on your mastery of a level of performance based on some stipulated criteria that is in the judging. Another um, benefit of competition is that it serves as a very, very strong uh, motivational yardstick. Okay? So some students are already at the peak of their learning and to push them even further, uh, competitions help to motivate the student to practice and push themselves a little bit even beyond their level, current level. Okay, because uh, the competitions usually take a certain amount of rigor. All right, you need great technical mastery at your instrument. You also need great uh, confidence. Uh, you need exposure to lots and lots of performing um, avenues. And therefore then, performing at the competition is great motivation for the student to put in the extra rigor to prepare for the competition. 
and by that I usually mean three to six hours of daily practice and it's not just uh, for the student that would only practice 30 minutes a day or once or twice a week. Uh, competitions are not for that kind of student. So um, that's it for today on the value of competition.